Hello again, YouTubers! Minerno3 of eBay on YouTube and owner of ToyGamingEmporium.com back here again with an unboxing video for the Trash Pack. Now, this is a brand new release. I've only seen these so far at Toys R Us stores. It is called the Trash Pack Series 1, the gross gain in your garbage. This is produced by Moose Toys, the same as Mighty Beans and Gomu. However, those are in collaboration or whatever with Spin Master. This item is not. It's just a sole project, whatever you want to say, by Moose Toys. It says you can look for the limited edition trashies. And there are different groups on here. It's like Mighty Beans have teams and such. There are the Grubs, Hard Rubbish, Bin Sex, Bin Critters, Bin Monsters, Bin Fections. You can see green is common, yellow is rare, blue is ultra rare, and purple is special edition. You can see there's a few special editions there down the sides. They look like they're glow in the dark and stuff. I believe I believe they are glow in the dark. Trashpack.com. Colors and contents may vary. Please retain packaging details for future reference. Do not eat the trash pack. Only use under adult supervision. Contains five trashies, five trash cans, and one collector's booklet. It says there's over 100 to collect and swap. And I think that pretty much covers everything that's on the packaging. I also have a pack that contains 12 of them that I'll probably unbox in the very near future as well. But we'll start off with a smaller one here just to get a full look at it. Look at the collector guy and all that good stuff. Not sure if I will offer these on toygamingemporium.com or not. If you are interested in these, please comment and let us know to help us gauge what interest there is in them. If there is a large interest in these, we will, of course, carry them, just like we do Mighty Beans and Gomer Racers and all that good stuff. Alrighty. So, first off, we'll look at the collector guide here. I don't know if there's any games or anything you can play with these as well, but I suppose we may find out in a second here. Looks like it only shows different guys. So there are more than what it shows in the back of the packaging, I think. Because there you can see for the grubs, there's just two rows of them. But here, the grubs is all of these. There's a lot more. You can see they are numbered. 001, 002, etc. Awful pie, rancid steak. Not going to go over all of them. I'm going to guess dumpling there, number 5 is an ultra rare. It actually shows on the back, number 5. So it looks like they're actually... A total of 51 of the grubs. Then there's different. So let's see. There's three different dumpling. There's a yellow dumpling, a green dumpling, and looks like a bluish one. So although there's 51 up here, perhaps others are done in different colors or whatever. Yep. So here we got a blue putrid pizza, and there's a gray one. So although they're Let's see, the numbering on here goes up to 166. So, not sure how many different designs there are, if you take out the consideration of the different colors. You know, there have been monsters with three different compost monster colors, so there may be as little as 166 divided by three, which would be roughly, let's see, 50 and five, well, 55 or 56 different designs, if there are three different colors for every one, but, Looks like something there'll be two of. Down here we got bird flu twice, and then we got flu virus, moo cow disease, chicky pox, flu eating virus, so two of each of those, so. Assuming all of them are at least doubled though, that means there'd be at most 83 different, so. Anywho, obviously there's no games or anything showing there, just all the different trashies and showing all the different colors, so. I guess let's see which ones we actually got then. Not sure if I'll actually look at what numbers they are because it might be kind of hard to find them unless there's a number on them. But as you can see here, they come each with a trash can. <laughs> and he's actually totally enclosed in that. Oh, huh, they're actually kind of rubbery, you can see. So kind of like squinkies, only larger. So that's kind of nice, actually. And you can see they still got the hole in the bottom, so you can probably put on pencil tops and stuff. So while squinkies are for boys or girls, in general, most of the Squinkies are more grill-based, other than like the Hot Wheels and Marvel ones, stuff like that. So this is more of like a gross type of Squinky, really, for the boys and stuff to put on their pencils at school or whatever and be more gross or whatever. So this one is Scabby Cat number 133, I believe. I'm not going to do this for all of them, but okay, 131 actually, my bad. So you can see Scabby Cat. 
believe that's the one, 131. And I do not see the number anywhere on the toy itself. Just says on the bottom, fit focuses, moose, China. So, not gonna know the numbering just by looking at the toy. You'll have to look at the collector guide as well. You can see the garbage can is kind of translucent. You can see my finger inside there. So, if we do end up selling these on the website, we will likely ship them all within the trash can. So, unless there are ones that don't come with a trash can each, I have to, have to look at the air pack and see if you get 12 trash cans and 12 trashies or what. But I'm sure we did include at least a couple of trash trash cans with each trashy. Well, at most one for each. Actually, let's see. That's the only translucent one, actually. The other ones are all solid in color. So our second one here looks like a fish with his ribs or whatever showing. Kind of a rotting fish gut. <laughs> Not sure what one he'd be under. Um, take a quick glance if I see him. Oh, yep. There he is, Smelly Fish, number 16. And that's also a common. I probably will look up to screen. We only have five here, and I want to know if we get like one rare and four commons or what exactly. All right, next up here we have looks like a green or gray slug type of thing. Let's see if I can find that one. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Not seeing it. Trash a pillar. Muggy Maggot, maybe? No. Nope, there we go. He is number 103, Germ Worm. Kind of interesting that actually all the ones we've got so far are actually on the back of the pack in the right color as well. So that's three commons so far. Hopefully you get, I would assume you get at least one rare in here. I would hope. Ah, this one must be a rare because it's actually clear in color. So that's kind of cool. That one looks like it's a cow. So that would be a Binfections. It's actually only yellow on the back of the pack, but down here, Moon, Moon, Moo Cow Disease. So it's blue, so that one's actually an ultra rare. So very cool. Not bad. Keep him out just because he's the highlight of the pack, probably. Then our last one here, got a red, is it a fire hydrant, maybe? Oh, I didn't notice it, but... They probably all have this. There's a little T symbol on there. It's probably help with against like counterfeits and stuff. Yep, that one's got higher up, up there if you can tell. Kind of hard to see. There you go. So they got a little symbol, a little T with a little bubble or whatever around it. And this guy, not a bin monster, not a bin infection, not a bin critter. Hard rubbish. Yep. Okay, he's actually a bottle. Here you go, Bashed Bottle, number 71. So, in our pack here, we got four commons and one ultra rare. I can't say for sure being the only pack we've done here, obviously, but I'm gonna guess in a five pack, you get four commons and one either rare or ultra rare. These special editions, I'm not sure if you can get within these kind of packs, or there's like different packaging that I have special editions exclusively in, or what the case may be. I'll probably do some more videos for these as I said though I got a 12 pack that I'll be opening soon so hopefully a little bit, learn a little bit more the more we open and stuff so if you haven't already done so make sure you subscribe you can then get emailers for our future videos here on Mean 03 feel free to send us your phone requests we accept them all give us a big thumbs up for a great new toy opening and review if you're interested in these potentially to buy or whatever please comment and let us know Rather, you want to see more videos of it or if you are interested in potentially buying some or both. So we know if we should do a lot more videos for these and or carry them on the website, etc. So with that, I thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next video.